Water is not only important, it's also powerful. So powerful that it affects how the earth spins. Over the years, humans have been overusing water, especially the groundwater. We deplete about 75 trillion gallons of water every year. We're sucking the earth dry, and this is changing how it spins. The earth's tilt, or the axis, has shifted by more than 31 inches. And this is not good news for us. Our next report tells you why. We humans love water. We can't live without it, but we don't know how to live with it either. Groundwater makes up 99% of Earth's liquid fresh water, and the world over, it's being depleted rapidly. By how much? About 75 trillion gallons a year. We have pumped out colossal quantities of water, and this has changed how the planet spins. Earth spins on its axis. This is an imaginary rod around which the planet turns. Between 1993 and 2010, humans pumped out 2,150 gigatons of groundwater. And this shifted the axis by 31.5 inches. In other words, excessive groundwater pumping has deviated the planet. So how did this happen? You see, the Earth is not a perfect sphere. It's kind of shaped like a potato, lumpy and imperfect. Its surface is filled with mountains, plains and water bodies. They are spread across the planet. And with this topography, the planet spins. It's constantly spinning like a top. Now, what would happen if you shift a mountain range? What if you moved an ocean? Or if you sucked the groundwater dry? Any of these things would move the mass on this potato top. Its balance would go awry. And the potato, or the planet, would wobble. That's exactly what's happening now. With enough water removed from the planet thanks to groundwater overuse, the planet is wobbling. Its axis has shifted. And this is not good news for us. It's a sign of the problematic times ahead. It was only in the early 2000s that scientists first saw a similar change. The Earth was behaving strangely. Its spin was out of balance. The Earth's tilt had shifted and nobody knew why. All hell broke loose. It was only about a decade later that scientists learned why. And the answer was stranger than the scenario itself. The axis changed because of global warming, because the polar ice sheets were melting, the glaciers were melting. So, believe it or not, water influenced our planet's spin, because again, mass was moved around on the planet. Back then, humans were to blame for the tilt. Today as well, humans are to blame, and we will suffer the consequences of it. While the shift is not apocalyptic in itself, it is a cause for worry. Thanks to climate change, sea levels are rising. They are expected to rise by a foot by 2050. Earth's tilt will only exacerbate the situation. When the planet shifts while spinning, it redistributes the matter on its surface too, like the water. So, when Earth tilted by 31.5 inches, it caused about 0.24 inches of sea level rise. While this may not sound like much, the average sea level has risen 8 inches since 1880. This has been enough to make floods and storms worse, to displace thousands, to put whole cities and even countries at the risk of sinking. So, it's hard to ignore the sinking feeling that even a minute increase in sea level would make these repercussions much worse. So our planet's tilt is the collateral damage in this war between man and earth.